Hello and welcome to a brand new episode of Fisher Online. Today we are back at Pra, the redone Pra, and we are gonna travel all the way up north, maybe here to this bend. I'm gonna see. I don't know. Uh, maybe to here, and I'm gonna try uh, for starlets. All right, I, we need to find a spot for starlets. You can see 12 kg on crayfish. Uh, so all of my setups, I only have two right now. That of crayfish, dice two hook, and crayfish sturgeon. I'm gonna remove the sturgeon, and I'm just gonna put crayfish on this. Uh, last one is just with the twist nord. I'm gonna try spin fishing a little bit while I wait. So go on from there. Go ahead. And all this up now we need to be aiming the other way uh j vehicle very poorly done it's very annoying it's not fun to drive at all so i hope he fixes this this is not a boat please don't treat it like a boat look at it, it turns like a boat too it's terrible uh, so I don't see why I want to drive now also you can zoom out and you can look for mushrooms apparently that is cool uh, let's see if you find any or like this how are we doing here oh we'll be there soon oh this pedals all the way down to the floor now 34 kilometers per hour. Oh boy, this is scary. <laughs> this is scary indeed. Uh, mushrooms. Oh, we're down to 23 now. I think we're going uphill maybe. They should be coming up here. The mushrooms. I remember, I think, I, last episode I found them here somewhere. Oh, by those cut trees, I think? I hope we can see them from here. Because that would make our life easier if we could just drive and have a look because our camera is a lot higher so we can look further out uh i don't think so maybe we're going too fast but i didn't see anything let me know if you guys did This looks cool. Oh, we're here. Okay. Beautiful. Look at this. Uh, what is this? Catch chub. Why are there pikes here? Uh, what distance am I going to put? I don't know. Like 15 meters, maybe? Ooh, that's too much. 25. Uh, let's put this as 20. Damn, we got massive weight on, on us. Let's do this as 15. Perfect. All right, we got 20 meters and we got 15 meters. Like this is the deep, deeper side. So that's where I want to cast. And let's see how this goes. Hopefully uh, they are around here. And I'll just throw in for the pikey boys. See how that goes. I love it. Look at that. Look at the trees. There's one tree that's like growing sideways a little bit. 
Uh, there's a bend in the river. The reflections are amazing. Bird sounds, your nature. Mmm. Just amazing level design. Even if I don't catch a fish, like, I feel so at peace. Just amazing. Uh, please, for the love of God, Wolf, change the fish models. They look ugly. They're the weakest part of the game, damn it. Change them. <laughs> if he is watching. Uh, but maybe I'll ask around. In the chat, I see people fishing and I'll ask them, Hey, you know, where, where are starlets? Because uh, I was told here. So, let's see. I'll wait. I'll wait it out. I'll find a spot. I don't know about starlets, guys, but I think I found a pike spot already. I already got a 7kg pike. I feel like this is another pike. Uh, at the bottom right, you can see what lure I'm using. I'll show you guys after I catch this. Uh, but I'm doing the daily quest mission, which is the really good one. 380 bucks plus 500 experience. 38 kg of uh, any fish. What are you? Another pikey boy. 6 kg. Man, we're going to complete this quest in no time. I'm using Vibro Shad M3, and that is uh, what's on the weeklies as well. Where are you, Pike? Look at this, 10 kgs. That's insane. Uh, someone said C2 and 3. Perfect. We are in the right spot, uh, if that's what they're saying. Perfect. Okay. Uh, maybe a night they bite. I don't know. I'm gonna I'm gonna wait a bit and see. Oh we got something, we got something, we got something. We got something, yay! It's tiny though. Please be starlet. Bite rate is a little slow though. What the heck is that? Oh that is a starlet. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, what the heck is this? Oh, it's a little baby. Okay, okay. Five meter. Ah, oh, there we go. There we go. Uh, this one I cast it a little bit closer this time. Still looks like a little baby here. 3 kg, hmm. Five meter depth. All right, this guy, I'm going to cast hair. Apparently this is it. Uh, 4.8 meter depth. Why does it do that? And 30 meters, really? All right, 30 meters. All right, we'll cast that there and see some on someone's suggestion from in game. And then this is what I did. I just cast it here between 15 to 20 meters in this deeper side. And uh, we have two starlets, two small ones. So let's see how this goes. All right, look at that. Again, this is the only one. Oh, wow. Okay, okay. This is the only rod out of the two that has gotten starlets. The other one still does not have it. And this is also uh, the setup that has the uh, sturgeon ground bait on it. Uh, so maybe you need that to catch him. But you know what? I'm going to recast the other one to the same spot as this guy. 
I think 15 meter is better than the 20 meter. Although I did cast a full 20 for this guy. So. Ooh, hopefully no. I thought our mission our mission would be complete, but yeah, a deed is opened. 7.88 kg large sterlet. There we go. Finally. Damn. All right, let's cast this. I'm sure that is a 20 meter clip. Five meter depth. And that's great. Look at the pikes I've been catching here, guys. Hmm. Uh, let's check this deed. Uh, pike is done. What did I just get right now? These are fishermen. Any sturgeon? Sturgeon big went down to 20 pieces. What is this? I wish it would tell us. Ah, there we go. Smoked herring. Extravagant bunch of pieces of smoked herring. It will obviously be to the taste of sturgeon. Okay. Cool. Look at the rainy weather. Amazing. And it has fog. So I have three rods going. <clears throat> My number three is a smaller rod. I have the lucky bait and mollusk piece because that also caught sterlets. Uh, but even then, this is the only rod getting anything. So I have to see what's different here. Like 49 kg titanium liter. Uh, the other setup also has the same thing. So not sure why. This is the only thing getting sterlets. Oh, you know what? It's because of the ground bait. Damn it. Let me try putting ground bait on the second rod too. 6.3. Hmm. There we go, God. Oh no. What's happening? There's an explosion. Is there a nuclear bomb going off? Uh, I'm scared. Is this a shockwave coming towards us? Oh, it slowed down. Okay. Whew. All right. That was, uh, that's really scary. <laughs> oh boy. Now this is remember 18 kg setup. So even a six kg might push us like this. Hopefully this is an evening overnight nocturnal fish. Damn, someone got a gold encrosion trophy. Okay, good for you. Good for you. Look at that. That's how you power level through this. Oh wow, I brought him all the way here. I heard water splashing and I thought he was still in the water. 8.2 kg, hot damn. There we go, bruv. 8.8 kg. Hmm. Uh, the mollusk lucky fishing. 18 kg reel, 20 kg fluorocarbon. Took a while. 20 meter clip here again. Uh, forget this. I'm not using that. Uh, delete. I'll just put it here. Oh man, what? I wish I could click this and put it here. That's not good. I'm going to put this for myself. That sterlets are here. Uh, but I'm not allowed to do that for some reason. So, 5 meter depth. Just make sure whatever clip you use, just... Make sure it's a 5 meter depth here. At 1 and C2 in between. Where I'm, where I am. Finally. A second rod. Finally. I still haven't put ground bait on this guy. Because I was waiting to get a bite. Man, look at that weather. I love it. 
All right, that Colin dude is just going at it on those Crucians here. Um, they have to be in the vicinity, right? Because I know when you're far away on the map, your fish are not shown to people who are far away from you. So all of these people are close by somewhere. So, sadly guys, I know back in the day, uh, the old pra used to have an amazing starlet spot. That's where I did my quick level up and money making. And now it's just not there. It's... I mean, you can catch Sterlet's hair, but it's slow. Oh, that's a burbot. 7.9 kg burb. I'll take it. Let's go ahead and put... Uh, I don't want to waste Sturgeons because I'm not going after Sturge. So I'll just put the Lucky. 8 fish balls. And go with that five meters let's get rid of this uh so this is the mission i completed i wish this would be a separate mission metal set plus 1800 xp honestly i should have done this i looked at the money oh you get angler token with this one i think that's more valuable to me because metal set i don't know what i'm gonna do with that in order to make tent or something i don't know so uh, so far, so good. 8.8 kg Starlet we have now. As nighttime comes, you can get in big trouble here with the Wells Cat. And it is becoming nighttime, so let's see what happens. There we go. Ooh. Look at the lighting now. The sun is setting behind us. Beautiful. Ooh, it's a bream. What the heck? 4.3 kg large bream. I mean, if this was a trophy, it'd be super awesome. <laughs> oh, man. Alright, we got another one over here. Is this going to be as big as our 8.8? I don't think so. Nice looking. 7.9. Mmm. Noise. Okay, okay, okay. So the second Sterlet in a row on the second rod. This entire time we didn't, we, didn't, we didn't get a single fish on this and now all of a sudden. So it seems all of these rods are taking turns. <laughs> um... You know, it'd be awesome if we could catch, you know, two Sterlets on two rods at a time. That'd be pretty cool. Or at least have two, you know, different fish on at the same time. Or three. Oh, is that a burb again? Really? 6.9 kg. Alright, so definitely this is the spot here. You want to catch Starlet, so let's go back home and see how much money we made before we pull this in. Oh, it's a tiny fish. If it doesn't take line out, it means it's a tiny fish on this setup. Just bring it in. Bring it in, boil. There we go. Is that another bream? Yes, it is. 4 kg large bream. Damn. Eventually we'd get a trophy bream. Alright. Not too bad, honestly. Not too bad at all. Can I cook something here? Nothing. Alright. 630 silver. Not that great of a money. If I'm being honest with you. Compared to before. Uh, for a low-level map, this is really good money. And these sterlets ain't big. So even with my 18 kg setup, you guys saw it took literally under 30, sec 30 seconds to bring in this 8.8 kg large sterlet. So as a new player, 
Uh, the spot is still amazing. It is not as amazing as it used to be uh, in the old pro. But nevertheless, this is a really good spot if you are a new player. You need XP, you need money. Uh, definitely come here. Nighttime, just be careful. You can catch Welts catfish here on crayfish. And they are going to be... They're going to mess you up. Uh, so, very nice. I'm happy with that. I'm glad Sterlets still exist on this map. And they're not scattered or very rare. Or anything of that sort. So you can use crayfish, mollusk, or crawfish tails. Uh, on mollusk, I believe it was our biggest one. Uh, but it doesn't really matter. I think both will do really good. And then if you only have two bottom fishing rods, throw vibro shad. Uh, I'm sure you can catch other fish on spin fishing as well. You just, you know, keep using different lures until you start getting it. Look at this M3. All the Xanders are on M3. And you know what? This spot is very probably amazing for Xanders right now since it's nighttime. All I had to do was fish with M3 and maybe we could have gotten a trophy here at this spot. So hope it helped. Hope you enjoyed this episode. We were just exploring, finding out spots and we did and I'm happy. So, like, subscribe, comment below. I'll see you next time. Until then, guys, enjoy.